In this video, I'm going to show you how to delete a sandbox in Oracle Fusion Cloud environment. So I'm going to go to Fusion and I'm going to quickly show you in the Fusion Cloud how to do this. All right. So here we are in Oracle Fusion Cloud and we have logged in as financial implementer. And presently we are in release uh, 21B of Oracle Cloud application, which is uh, supposed to be the latest uh, Oracle Fusion Cloud. Now, in order to delete a sandbox, the first thing you have to do is go to the sandbox page. So you can go via the main menu or um, via this uh, user. So I'm going to go to this uh, hamburger menu and from here I'm going to scroll down slowly and here it's hidden. So I'm going to click on more. So it will show me all the hidden items and then you see under configuration I've got something called a sandboxes. So I'm going to click on this sandboxes. So it's going to open the page for sandboxes. You see here now there are a number of uh, sandboxes which have been created by a number of users just for testing purposes. So in order to delete a sandbox first I will enter a sandbox like this. Okay and then you simply go to actions and then hit the delete button so this sandbox will be deleted and all changes in the sandbox will be lost do you want to continue so i'm going to click on yes so this sandbox sus test02 will be deleted likewise uh, i'm going to go and delete uh, the other sandboxes which are not required i'm going to say yes so this sandbox will be deleted as well now how would you confirm that sandboxes has been deleted so you see that under available sandboxes that particular sandbox is not showing anymore and once you have deleted your sandboxes you will immediately not be able to view those deleted sandboxes over here at the moment so as you could see here deleted sandboxes will be purged only uh, after you run a schedule process so basically you have got to run a process to purge those sandboxes from the fusion cloud so what is that uh, schedule process uh, and how to run it basically you have got to go to the hamburger menu and from here you navigate to tools and within tools you go to schedule processes and within schedule processes you hit this button schedule new process and then you look for something with the name of uh, sandbox and this process will be pulled automatically purge sandbox job and then you hit the OK button and these are some process options so whether you want to schedule it and you would like to be notified and once you're done you hit the submit button and process number 33847271 was submitted hit the ok button and then wait for a while to have this process completed so keep refreshing using this uh, button refresh so as you could see presently it is waiting for the previous job to complete and status will change it may take a couple of minutes so you see this is fast so this is succeeded and let's see if there is any output and log file associated wherein we can see the details of uh, the output so that's the output file let me download and open it for you all right so this is the output so it started the purge sandbox job profile option fnd deleted sandbox retain count value is 10 and completed the purge sandbox job so hit the OK button and I don't know what is there in log file you can view under this one as well because most of the time it is messages from the background stored packages and procedures so as you could see the log file contains exactly the same messages as the output file I don't know why but it's pretty much the same thing so I'm going to cancel and come out of this um, schedule processes and just refresh to make sure if at all there are anything else which is run in the background in terms of dependencies so there are nothing 
okay so at this time I believe uh, we can go back to sandboxes and check the sandboxes status out there so go to tools and then under under configuration you look for sandboxes that's the process under which you delete the sandbox and then purge it from the system